Hello everyone, welcome back to my Jurassic Rest War Simulation Core. And now we continue with the Builder session in our course. In the Builder session, there are several main features I should introduce for you before we go to the detail of Builder module. So, you can see that in the Builder, In the builder, there are several options for you to build the reservoir simulator. You can build the leg oil simulation by MS simulator. And also regarding the thermal and chemical, you can consider the star for simulation. And gem, you can consider for conversational, such as C2 enhanced oil recovery, C2 sweat jason. Basically, you need to perform the builder and start with the IMED. And then, from the IMED, you use the builder to convert directly to star and gem. So, basically, you need to build the IMED first, and the other simulator will be easily. Therefore, in this simulation call, we will focus in on like our simulator IMS. The other simulator I will introduce later in the advanced call. And now we go with the builder session. This is the general information you need to import one by one before you start to run in the simulation data. First, I talk about the input output control. In this option, you can define the simulation or state we show output. You depend on your selection. So whatever you define here, the simulation result will export for you. And next, we go to the reservoir session. In the reservoir session, you need to consider about the restructure, property, and the other information. Also, from reservoir, you can view the local model directly in CMZ by import the Komodo Rumbechel. The component regarding the component, you need to provide the fluid model, so they lack oil property, compositional property, or even thermal property. In that session, you need to consider a rock fluid. For the rock fluid, you need to build the relative permeability curve, capillary reserve, and the other information. After you fill the information for rock fluid interaction, you need to provide the information about the initial condition. So today, you need to provide the initial reserve or initial saturations, bubble reserve of the reservoir. After you finish the initial condition filling, the input information. You go with the numerical. For the numerical, we will talk about a simulation step, the minimum and maximum time step for your simulation, and other scenarios such as implicit and implicit in the numerical control. Regarding the real mechanic, it is optional option, so you don't need to consider so much about it option. Or if you would like to study about your mechanic, you can perform information here. The final session is the well and recurrent. For well and recurrent, you need to consider about the well preparation, the other information of the well, producer and well injector, such as injection ray, producer ray, and the other information you need to make the constraint uh, you would like to define. That's all about the general information about the builder. The next session I will introduce for you about the reservoir system in this simulation call.